The words CF and tech, for me, they don't really go together. I mean, the only CF tech I remember growing up was this thing. And I remember when I was given this nebulizer and it was seen as an advancement due to its small form factor and quiet operation. Whilst I thought it was a step forward, undoubtedly this is a medical device. Everything about it says medical device. And with that came all the reasons to hate everything about it. It looks like CF, it sounds like CF, and let's face it, it's far from cool. And as far as personal CF tech goes, growing up, that was pretty much it. My earliest memory of a lung function device, for example, involved a half hour trip to the hospital in heavy traffic, sitting in waiting rooms until the nurse shouts my name, and then I'd quite literally step inside of and get attached to this huge machine in order to have my lungs tested. And my relationship with this thing was not good, and that's because it was all down to this mechanical monster whether I'd go home with an IV in my arm for the next two weeks or not. And more often than not, the monster said yes. Moving on from those days and the world of CF did start to catch up and now most CFers do have a handheld long function device which allows them to take readings from home. And I have a couple of these devices. This one was one that I received from the hospital last year. And before that, I had to buy my own from Amazon. And I got this around six, five or six years ago. They work by measuring a few key things, but most important is FEV1. Forced expiratory volume within one second. Or in other words, after taking a deep breath in, how much of that air can you blow back out again within the first second? And the results of these tests allow medical professionals and doctors to get a view of how well our lungs are performing, how restricted the airways are, when compared to a healthy individual of the same height, weight and age. And, you know, these devices, they, they do the job. Yes, the results may vary, but they prevent me from having to make that trip to the hospital, to sit in those waiting rooms. And it's been a blessing during the COVID pandemic. But aside from all of that, just look at them. Just like that tractor of a nebulizer, they look like CF and they feel like CF. And CF tech, it's just not cool. Or is it? This is the Nuvo Air Air Next lung function device. Finally, it's CF tech that stands so far out from the crowd might take your breath away. It's just 98 millimeters long and weighs 75 grams. It tracks a range of respiratory values including vital capacity and of course old faithful FEV1. Its matte black finish is not only different to any other CF tech I've seen, but uniquely and finally, it's a piece of CF tech I might actually want to show off. Look at the packaging. I mean, you'd be forgiven for thinking this was the latest iPhone or something. The box is well made, the branding carefully designed, and the whole thing would look right at home at Curry's PC World. This thing is so far beyond what I'm used to when it comes to CF and tech that honestly, when opening the box, it left me gasping in a good way. But it doesn't stop there. So on my screen right here, I have an Excel spreadsheet and it contains the records of my lung function test results from about the last 10 years or so. Each time I have a test, whether at home or at the hospital, I have to log onto this computer, create a new row, add the date and some comments about the device and how I was doing at the time. And then I manually key in the lung function data and I sit back and nothing happens. Nuvo Air, however, has it all worked out as it will automatically sync to your smartphone via the Nuvo Air app. It provides coaching and feedback to help improve technique. And of course, by taking regular tests, the app will plot the results into visualizations to help us identify and understand trends over time. But what about accuracy? Well, 
When researching this thing, I read three of the many studies that you have access to on the NouveauAir website, all of which agreed when tested hundreds of times and placed against the more traditional lung function machine that we know and trust at the hospital. The results showed perfect concordance between the two spirometers. And in addition to all of this, and I think perhaps its most genius party trick, is that after taking a test, the platform will ping the results back to a central portal for your CF team to pick up so they can keep a keen eye on your respiratory health from afar. And just think back to where we started in this video. I described the process I was used to many years ago of having to travel to the hospital to get my lungs tested. But what I didn't talk about was the psychological impacts of those appointments. Before the likes of NuvaWare, on the run up to my checkup, things would start to get a little uneasy, shall we say. And I'd start asking myself, how will my lungs perform? I mean, of course, I hoped they'd at least be stable, but more worryingly, would they be down? Would the results have fallen? And anything could happen on that day. You could simply be having a bad day after two or three months of feeling great. But whatever you blow on that day, it's committed to ink within your notes. And if the numbers aren't where the doctor would like them to be, interventions will kick in. And if you're lucky enough to leave the hospital on the same day, you tend to leave with one or two mindsets, either feeling great because you blew a really big score or in some sort of a daze, trying to figure out how you got here, where you go next. And trust me, the older you get and the lower those numbers fall, the more this plays on your mind. But thankfully, those days might be a thing of the past, thanks to new technology like the Nouveau Air, because it provides CFers with access to a rather more scientific approach one that's founded on results over time and trends. Not only does this avoid us and our CF team taking the potential outlier as gospel, but it listens to the patient across multiple data points and in turn can lead to a far more appropriate course of action, one that focuses on prediction, not panic. So when compared to its ancestors, the Nouveau Air is far more than a medical device and far more than what you just see here. It is a platform, an ecosystem, built to ensure that us CFers can self-monitor our respiratory health independently without clinical supervision, keeping us out of harm's way during a pandemic and beyond. But more than that, it's reassurance and confidence. And until we invent a device that quite literally predicts the future, with this platform, we can build a closer, more personal relationship with our health and stand the best chance of avoiding those previously inevitable, nasty CF surprises. And in the words of Dr. W. Edwards Deming, in God we trust. All others bring data. Cheers.